The overall goal of this procedure is to electrospin a three-dimensional triphasic scaffold, allowing for the co-culturing of fully differentiated adult human cells in order to replicate the natural extracellular matrix these cells encounter in situ. This is accomplished by first electrospinning a randomly aligned microfiber scaffold. The second step is to form a biphasic scaffold by electrospinning a randomly aligned nanofiber layer directly onto the microfiber scaffold. Next, a separate aligned nanofiber scaffold is electrospun. The final step is to seed each scaffold with their respective cell type, and to co-culture the scaffolds in a perfused bioreactor system as a single construct. Ultimately, multicellular interactions can be analyzed through measurement of mediator release and immunostaining the construct. The main advantage of this technique over existing methods like 2D transwall membranes is that electrospun scaffolds provide a 3D fibrous environment that can be adapted to provide a physiologically relevant morphology. It's a more porous structure and allows the core culture of multiple cell types. This method provides a stable platform using either co-cultured diseased or healthy human cells as an in vitro model. This will help reduce our reliance on animal models, which have a limitation in their relevance to human disease, and decrease the number of animals used in experimentation. Though this method can provide insight into respiratory diseases, such as asthma and COPD, it can also be applied to other systems, such as for the study of inflammatory diseases of the intestine, or for the development of a skin model for chemical testing. To begin, prepare three different 10 milliliter solutions of PET by dissolving 8%, 10%.